We watch a good movie. We've planted enough trees. <laughs> <laughs> Ni mwezi mmoja ambao umepita tokea mwimbaji Esther Akoth anayetambulikana na wengi kama Akothe kuweza kuanzisha story kusiana na yeye kuweza kutengana na mmewe Omosh ama Dennis Twiza ambaye alikuwa ni raia wa nchi ya Uswizi ambaye ndiye alikuwa wamemaliza miezi mitatu au miine kwenye ndoa ila sasa fununu ambazo zinatujia kwa sasa ni juu ya akothe kuwa katika mahusiano ya kimapenzi na ambaye alikuwa mpenzi wake wa kitambo Nelly Hawks na pia ni rafiki wa karibu wa kifamilia kulingana na kile ambacho kinaendelea na kile ambacho kimeweza kuachiwa kwenye mitandao ya kijamii ni wazi kuhusu uhusiano wa akothe na Nelly Hawks kuwa ni uhusiano wa karibu sana Kumbuka wakati mwimbaji huyu alipopata kutengana na mmewe na kuweza ku, kuongea kwenye ukurasa wa kijamii wake wa Instagram alidai ya kwamba wakati alikuwa kipitia wakati mgumu watu ambao walikuwa wa karibu sana na yeye na watu ambao walipata kumsaidia kwa kiasi kikubwa ndipo kuweza kumaliza ku, ile e, certain phase ambayo alikuwa kwenye maisha yake phase ambayo familia ilikuwa ndio imejitenga na yeye na mambo mengi alikuwa ya kwende sawa aliyemsaidia ni Nelly Hawks na kulingana na video kidogo hiyo ambayo umeiona ikianza hapo inaonyesha akothe na Nelly Hawks wakiwa mahali vile na Nelly anasema ndio wamemaliza kupanda miti something that uh, has triggered a lot of reactions kutokea kwa Kenya na kuleta allegations ya kwamba you know what the old love has currently been Ricardo again ya kwamba mapenzi yamepata kurudiwa tena mapenzi yamepata kurejea tena mm? jambo mbalo linae lime, lime, limepata kush, kusisimua sana maongezi na ombea kwenye mitandao ya kijamii wakileta story kuhusiana na urejeo wa penzi la Codena Nelio I can I can say that wa, au watu wakati walikuwa pamoja na wakati mapenzi yao yalikuwa pamoja yo these people wa the best. Mm, Akothe alikuwa anaonekana mtu mwenye furaha, mwenye bashasha. E, alikuwa anaonekana mtu ambaye yupo kwa fu, yupo na furaha katika maisha yake. Lakini unajua mambo ndivyo yalivyo mara nyingi inaweza kuwa leo tunapendana, leo tunafanya kila kitu kwa pamoja. Leo mimi nasikia siyeziishi bila wewe. But the next day inakuwa mambo ni tofauti. Dunia inabadilika ndo maana mimi kama kuna kitu ambacho huwa nakichukia kukifanya kwenye maisha yangu ni kuwa na attachment na mtu ambaye najua mwisho wa siku mtu huyu atokaa katika maisha yangu milele hmm? awezi kaa na kutulia katika maisha yangu milele mwisho wa siku huyu mtu ataondoka but you know what since the love of Akothe and Nelly Hawks is about to begin again na tutakuwa tukiongelea sana you know these people never stop eh Yeah, but you unajua mara nyingi unagundua that somebody that mtu ambaye yupo there for you that somebody that is always fighting for you that somebody that wants the best for you is the person that you will always go for ako they went for Dennis eh but nikikukumbusha tu kutokea mwanzo Nelly Hawks was the eh, i mean yo tutakubaliana tuta na hilo mse alikuwa Indio ribi yako then yet you know things happen and people part ways but at the end of the day as long as nakutakia mazuri na nakupenda i will always want to see the best happen in your life hata tuwe maadui i will wish the best to happen for you in your life and that's what i've seen to in Nelly Oaks yeye hata kama aliona yako there ameoleka and all that he has always been wishing this woman nothing but the best And what, we ca what can we say? Eh, tuna, we are praying for a comeback of this couple man. Hii couple ilikuwa kapo ingine amazing sana huko mwaka 2021 na mwanzo mwanzo wa 2022. But you know what? Shit happens and this is the world that we live in. For now, na kuomba upate kusubscribe tuungane katika video zetu zijazo. Hii ni FM Show KE.
wa mpo